Draw the area model for 784 divided 6. You put 6 in the side of the left side on, on the left side. Now you put, you slice them three times for, for the hundreds and tens and ones. Now you put 784 on the hundreds place on, on top and you, and you check if six can go into seven from 784. And it goes in one time and add the zeros for the hundred place. And then six times 100 is 600. 600 minus 784 is 184. Now you put 184 to the tens place. And then how many times can seven go into one? It can't go in one, so you go, six goes into 18, how many times? Three times. S six times three equals 18 plus the zero equals 180. And then you subtract 184 minus 180. And that equals 4. Now you put the 4 on the 1's place. How many times can 6 go into 4? None, none times. You put a 0 on top of the 4. Now you add, now you uh, subtract 4 and 0. That equals 4. Then you add 100 plus 30 plus 0. 100 plus 30 plus 0 equals 130. Now to check, now to add the remainder. 4. And we're going to check it with the ordinary method. So how many times can 6 go into 7? One time. How many times can 6, how many, 6 times 1 equals 6. What is 7 minus 6? Bring down the 8 and put the 8. How many times can 6 go into 18? Three. Three. 3 times. 6 times 3 equals 18. Bring down the 4. How many times can 6 go into 4? 0 times. 6 times 0 equals 0. You subtract it and it equals 4. And the remainder is 4. 130, remainder 4. Yippee. <laughs>